It's time for a daily dose of victory, even if it's just a minute with the pastor. Hey, Baltimore, this is Pastor Tony Swift. This is another daily dose of victory. We're on the subject, let's keep caring for Baltimore. Today, we're going to ask you, those that have all the resources that are available, let's begin to care about the health of, of Baltimore getting the programs available and, and exposing all the great programs that Baltimore has available to deal with people's health, HIV and all those things that people are, are being challenged with and there are programs there to help us maintain, even our seniors as they get older, let's begin to, as a Balt in Baltimore, begin to expose or help the community be aware of what's available to make sure they maintain their health, what's available to make sure they be, uh, um, be concerned about their teeth and dentists and all those things that they need to do. You'd be surprised how many people is not going, is not maintaining a proper health and the tools are available but they're not aware of. So I'm, I'm, I'm telling you those that are medical programs and all these programs that are available, let's find some sort of avenue or some sort of media that helps us expose all the things that Baltimore has available to care for Baltimore. So Baltimore will not only be a good city, but also an incredible, healthy city. Let's care about Baltimore. On June the 20th at Mondaman Mall at 4 p.m. in the afternoon, the multicultural prayer movement, which consists of over 400 churches in the Mid-Atlantic region, are getting together to lift up the name of Jesus. We're changing protest to prayer and action because we believe that God wants to do great things in the Baltimore region. Would you come? We invite you on behalf of all of us. Come. Be bold. Be bold.